All right, so here we are. This is pretty basic 302. I haven't really done anything fancy with this engine other than clean it up. When I first got it, um, it's a rebuild, so it came with the car when I bought it. The Marty report does show an original, you know, 302, but the, this is a different engine than what was originally in the car. Um, I'll pop a picture in here so you can see what it looked like when I got it. And I think I even have a picture of when the guy I bought it from first got the car. One nice thing he did do is pop on those really nice Maverick valve covers. Those are fun when you take her to a car show. Uh, needed a ton of cleanup. Boy, this whole battery starter area was just a hot mess with loose wires and bare wires. It was pretty scary looking. So got that cleaned up. Put in a one wire alternator. Really happy with that. You know, looks good. Performs great. Much, much cleaner than all the scary stuff I had hanging off of there before. Let's see. Again, pretty basic. I've done the I've done electronic ignition. Had the carb tune. It's just a simple two barrel. I go back and forth a lot about do I want to slap a four barrel in this thing and I don't know. You know, I get in a lot of trouble with this car as it is. I don't know that I need personally uh, the secondaries to kick in. It could get me in even more trouble. This car is a lot of fun to drive. It's a lot of power for a lightweight, you know, just over 2,000 pound car. Let's see what else we have here. Yeah, pretty basic. Again, nothing real fancy. Just a nice 302 in this car. Um, did go in and have, we did a front disc uh, brake conversion. Got rid of the drums. Don't know that we can see it down here. There is a brand new way down there. Borgstrom. There it is. <laughs> Hard to see. Power steering unit that I had put in. So the power steering that came with this car was just a mix of the old leaky Ford power steering unit and some other stuff cobbled together. It just wasn't working well. Uh, was making a big mess everywhere. So in order to do that, in order to fit this in, I had to go in and... Uh, Changed my uh, my mechanic great guy went ahead and took out the column shift let's take a look at that I've probably shown you this before but column shift is now a floor shift because this thing had all those blown linkages that was a big problem see it's really nice and clean can't even tell it was a column shift he did a great job of cleaning it up and we've got the beautiful B&W floor shift. Really, really happy with how that turned out in this car. Nice chrome handle. Anyway, we cleaned this up to make room for that power steering system, but I also was having that challenge with the... Um, where the car would jump into reverse. <laughs> You'd have it in park and it would the linkage would slip and it would pop into reverse and shoot backwards when you started it so that cleaned that up no longer an issue so there you go this is our girl our 302 next up we'll go ahead and fire her up for our commenter that said too bad she doesn't run let's get a quick shot of her running